Okay, here we are down at the blowers again. And last year we introduced our single V, a uh, really nice piece, a little bit more performance and movement of water than the single round for a flash dry. It worked real well. Well, our, our, our partner that was doing the nozzles, we actually said, hey, let's, what if we take the Dunks bill, turn it into a V? So we got the double V. So we have the double V, we have the single V, and then we also have now at the very end, our flip V. The whole idea of the V nozzle is when it hits the car, it moves water, not only back, but out to the sides. It's much easier to move water three feet right, three feet left, than it is 10 feet or 20 feet up over the hood, whole front and back of the car. So by putting all these together, we're actually spreading water out, we're moving it again, we're keep moving the right direction. Um, the mammoths together in different places really work well. We're flipping these at the mirrors. Again, I'm gonna say it again, if you don't flip at the mirrors, you're missing out on the performance of the mammoths. And you need two sets to do that correctly. But single V, double V, if we have the room and one more arch, then we can do our, our split Vs. When we get down to the end, we have a round pivoting nozzle here just to get most of the water off the car. And then we also have now our flip V. So it's doing the same thing. It's going up over the hood, just like the first one, shoving everything out to the sides, making sure we get rid of all those drops. And when it flips over, it does the same thing. It flips over and it blows the water not only down, but it blows it down and out. So we're actually stripping that water down and we're drying all the way down to the bumper. The car is so dry when it goes into the buff and dry that we get the best quality car I've ever seen.